Welcome to Pharmachem Insights. Today we are going to discuss some important question and answers on polarimeter instrument. So let's get started. First question: What is the principle of polarimeter? A polarimeter is an instrument that measures the angle of rotation of plane polarized light by passing polarized light through an optically active substance. What is the USP general chapter for polarimeter? The USP general chapter number for polarimeter is 781. Next question. What is the light source of polarimeter? A sodium vapor lamp is used as a light source for polarimeter. Why sodium lamp is used in polarimeter? Due to its high energy output as it contains mercury, sodium vapor lamp is used in polarimeter. Next question. What is the wavelength of sodium lamp used in polarimeter? So the wavelength is 589.4 nanometer. Next question. What is the instrumentation of the polarimeter? A polarimeter consists of six components. First a light source. Second one a monochromator that filters out all but a single specific wavelength. Third a polarizer that converts the single light beam to a plain polarized light. Fourth is a sample tube that holds a sample which is to be measured. Fifth a second polarizer to determine the degree of rotation. Sixth a light detector. What is the angle of rotation in polarimeter? So when a polarized light is passes through the optically active substance the amount by which the light is rotated is known as angle of rotation. Next question. What is the unit of a polarimeter? The unit of polarimeter is degree. Next question. What is dex rotatory and levo rotatory? When the plane polarized light passes through the compound, as a result some compound rotates the plane polarized light clockwise plus are called dex rotatory and some rotates it anti-clockwise minus are called as levo rotatory. Next question, difference between OR and SOR that is optical rotation and specific optical rotation. The first optical rotation, it is the rotation of light when it passed through an optically active solution at normal temperature which is not specified and in specific optical rotation it is like optical rotation only means examine the same but at specific temperature like 20 degrees celsius. What is the formula of SOR? So the formula for SOR is alpha is equal to alpha observed divided by C into L. So alpha is equal to specific optical rotation. Alpha observed is observed optical rotation. C is concentration of solution. L is path length of cell. Next question. What are enantiomers? Enantiomers are a pair of molecules that exist in two forms that are mirror images of one another but cannot be superimposed one upon the other. You can see the example of tartaric acid. In this two enantiomers are mirror images of each other but cannot be superimposed. Difference between enantiomers and diastereomer. Enantiomers are stereoisomers that are non-superimposable mirror images while diastereomers are stereoisomers that are non-superimposable non-mirror images.
नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन वॉट इज कायरल कार्बन ऑल्सो कॉल्ड ए सीमेट्रिक कार्बन आंसर इज कार्बन एटम अटैच टू फोर डिफरेंट ग्रुप्स इज कायरल कार्बन विच सोल्यूशन इज यूज टू कैलिब्रेट पोलरिमीटर सुक्रो सोल्यूशन विद अ डिफाइंड कंसंट्रेशन इज यूज टू कैलिब्रेट द पोलरिमीटर नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन वॉट इज रेसमिक मिक्सचर रेसमिक मिक्सचर इज वन डेट हैज इक्वल अमाउंट ऑफ लेफ्ट and right handed enantiomers of a chiral molecule what is the optical rotation of a racemic mixture optical rotation of racemic mixture is zero because each enantiomer rotates the plane polarized light in an equal but in opposite direction and is optically inactive next question why sucrose solution is used For calibration of polarimeter, sucrose solution is optically active. It is ideal sugar for testing and calibration, as it has well-known rotation angle and high level of purity. Thank you. Please like, share, and subscribe my videos so I will get motivated to create more videos of this kind. Bye.